it was 27 years ago to this day that America and the world fell in love with a rubber puppet. That's right, E.T. the Extraterrestrial. Hello, I'm Chris Caniff. And I'm outside the home, the actual location. No, no, let's go again. That one is terrible. Where E.T. was shot. You may <clears throat> remember this house. Cut, cut, cut. Let's do it again. I'm sure it's burnt into many, many of our hearts. Not long ago. Cut. No, 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 no. Steven Spielberg took us on an adventure that would warm all of our hearts. Cut, cut, cut. Let's do it again. Tonight's commentary. No, let's do it again. It's a commentary about the neighborhood and how it's changed dramatically. You see, 27 years ago, this neighborhood was a flourishing cornucopia of warmth and camaraderie, a community that was brought together. Back then, you would have, at this time, you would have seen children dressed up in their Halloween fatigue, in armies, in droves, knocking on homes, collecting candy with smiles on their faces. But today, this neighborhood is a barren wasteland. Tell them to shut the goddamn thing off. Jose, hey, 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 shut it off, shut it off. Shut it off, bud. Thank you. Tell them to shut that goddamn thing off. Seven years ago, on this date, uh, during Halloween, um, you might remember a, uh, a movie by the name of E.T. was filmed here. Oh, yeah. E.T. the Extraterrestrial. And um, uh, now we're doing a, a commentary 27 years later, an editorial on the neighborhood and how it is now. Um, do you remember this neighborhood? Were you around? No, not remember. Uh, you didn't see E.T.? No. Because oh, he... Yes, you want to talk to him the... E.T. the Extraterrestrial. You want to talk to him the... Oh, yes. Uh, how are you, sir? I'm sorry, we're doing... Uh, my name is Chris Kana. Afternoon, sir. Chris Kane of Dateline NBC. How you doing today? Oh, God. Here he comes with that damn blower again. And how Halloween was uh, celebrated here in this neighborhood 27 years ago, as it, as opposed to how it's not celebrated today. You mean because of E.T.? Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's, um, it's just curious to us, not only in this neighborhood, but uh, a lot of different neighborhoods Tell him to in California. Tell shut that where, goddamn where thing historical off. Historical film landmarks where... Halloween doesn't seem to be uh, 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 celebrated anymore. Um, is it, to your experience, it, does it have to do with uh, the times, or why don't we see children out here, you know, trick or treat? Uh, this way here because it's too up the hill. Oh, up the because, of, because the actual walking up the hill. Yeah, kids don't like going up hills. They go to the places, not, not today's era, but you really. My era. You went anywhere. <laughs> Back in those days, people lived in the hills and had money. And you'd go there to get the big candy bars. Okay. But here, we have the big, the nice candies and everything, but the kids don't, there's no little kids around here. Very, very few little kids. The only time we had a lot of kids here was when they made the movie E.T. That was 20, about 27. But that wasn't made, that was in this, on a set. That wasn't actually in this neighborhood, was it? No, they shot it. Oh, they shot it at that house for yeah, real? Yeah. No, oh, the hell is the matter with you? Jesus. Now, were you actually around during that time? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you were here. Do you have any, do you have any still photos for the documentary? Don't do that. What are you doing? All my kids, we took, we left there the second, third week at, uh, where they were making the movie and we went to Canada. Did they pay you to leave? You no, know, they, well, they paid us to use the house. Okay. And my kids stayed here, uh, and they they were in the movie. They were all in the in the, in the, in the, in the streets. Yeah. Wow! But they paid the user. You mean just the the? Yeah. Uh, they have the house in the movie. In the background. The uh -huh. Yeah. Well, not they bad. never dreamed that movie was going to go like that. Yeah. In fact, when they made it, it was called a, a life of a. Yeah, a boy's life. life or something or the other. Yeah. But she's that movie. Yeah. yeah. Spectacular. The kids don't even walk to school anymore. You know that. Right. Yeah. yeah. But Halloween, uh, uh, is do it right now, school. motherfucker. Let's do it. I don't know. I did. We decorate for it. We put little things out, you know, and everything else. Bring it on. I'll be surprised. Are there any? Yeah. Are there, will there be any kids out trick or treating? You think? There you might know? be. I don't know. We'll see tonight. We'll wait. You know, I never know. 
life's a mystery. We never know what's going to happen. But I know last year when the little one came, I had a whole bag of candy, and it was nine o'clock when it got here, and I gave her the whole. I gave her the whole thing. Oh. You see anyone? God, there's not a soul in sight. No one. Last year there was the last one three person. Years, the last three years has been really hardly anybody tapered off. Yeah. And then last year, like I say, one, one, one person. Huh. One person. Yeah. So are we the only two people this year? So far, <laughs> we're the only two. Now I, this might be a little, little off the what we're the track of what we're talking about, but uh, on the subject of ET and UFOs, I have heard that some people around this area, and when I say around this area, within like a, a 10, 20 mile radius. Uh, have actually seen, have had sightings of, uh, you know, things that can't be explained up in the sky. Have you personally ever seen a UFO of any type? Mm. A little bicycle, kid on a bicycle going across the moon or anything? What is Jose doing? <laughs> <laughs> Who believe ghosts, you know, coming back from the dead? Come on. Right. Look out! No, <laughs> That's the way. Yeah. I mean, some people believe in it. You know, the mind plays tricks on everybody. Right. Well, that's imagination. The people, imagination, the way people yeah. want to think. Well, that's great. I've never heard. I've never seen any ghosts up here. Or anything. If uh, if you ever come across uh, stills, can I give you my uh, email? Don't ask them for sure. What are you, you doing asking for stills? stills? When I clean out the garage, they're in there somewhere. I know <laughs> okay. the kids took all kinds of pictures. Uh, 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 there will, uh, there be, will uh, be money. Uh, money. Uh, money. Well, I will, well, I no, I, no, I, I insist on cutting you a check. What do you? So we'll do it. I'll have Sally over at the production studio cut you a check. I will do that for you. If I run across them, I'll give you a Thank call. Thank you very much. You've been really nice talking to you guys. Yeah, it's very, yeah. yeah. Have thanks a good so Halloween. much. Okay. <laughs> yeah, thanks. <laughs> See ya. Okay. Thank you. God, what the hell's the matter with you? What do you mean? Asking for stills? What? I thought people at home. What are you? God. I don't know. What the hell are you doing? Hey, how are you? Chris Kane of 60 Minutes? Get your cute buns over here for a second. I got a question for you. <laughs> how are you? Oh, sorry. I. <laughs> Would you, would you mind shaking that butt, that butt right over you? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Ask. <laughs> I'm just joking. Uh, how are you? Can I ask you a few questions? Is that a welcome mat or well, something you're holding? You were, you were probably not even born yet, but uh, you know there were, uh, according to your neighbor here, very nice guy. Um, um, hordes, hordes of children. Of chil uh, children. Uh, children. Uh, trick or treat. I mean, he, he said, said hundreds, hundreds and hundreds. And hundreds. It wasn't just what? like it was in the movie. It was even more, really? or even more kids. Um, nowadays. You know better than I was. What the hell is that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Down the street. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, Jesus. I wasn't wearing like a night. Okay. Wow. Have you ever seen a trick-or-treater at all? Yeah. Okay. So oh, you have? So they oh. do come out. So they do. Yeah, they do come out. Okay. Uh, well, according to your neighbor, um, uh, he said that uh, Whoa. in the last year, was one kid, and he, had, he said he bought a whole oh bag my of God. for everybody, and he said he was sitting there all night long, you know, he got dressed up himself, I think he said he was dressed up as a Darth Vader or something, he was sitting there by the front door, and uh, he wound up giving the whole pack of candy to one kid. Yeah, we've interviewed uh, we've interviewed uh, some people in the area who have had, had, have had recent UFO sightings here. Have you yourself witnessed any uh, uh, extraterrestrial phenomenon of any sort? Uh, there's a gentleman around the corner. His name's Chip. He's got a big mole on the side of his face. Okay. Oh, where he was, did he see it? He said it was right outside. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. He said he was having a couple beers and it was around nine o'clock at night. Maybe. Maybe he was doing something else too. Jesus. Okay. All right. Wow. Well, uh, thank you for your time. Happy yeah. Halloween. Thank you. And take care now. <laughs> Damn, she was nice. Great Jesus. Hello, I'm Chris Caniff. You re may recognize this home behind me. It was once occupied by Michael Myers, the renowned serial killer who stalked and killed his sister. Tried to kill his sister. 